Hello, I'm Carolyn Herbert from the Finance News Network and joining me from GenX Power to discuss its latest announcement is Executive Director Simon Kidston. Simon, welcome back. Thank you very much. Now, Simon, the company's just come out of a trading halt and has released an announcement in relation to its renewable energy project in North Queensland. Can you tell us a bit about it? A very, very significant announcement today. The, the Queensland Government has declared the Kidston Renewable Energy Hub critical infrastructure, which um, is a very, very, um, it's, a, it's a very significant declaration because they're one of only two projects in Queensland that has that status. Thanks. So can you tell us a little bit more about the significance of these declarations and what it means for Gen X in terms of moving forward? So, so what it means is the Queensland Government has recognised the, the Kidston Renewable Energy Hub is one of the high priority projects to be developed in Queensland. And I think it emphasises the fact that they're very willing to support this project get through the development stage so we can kick off construction in 2018. And Simon, clearly there's a strong push for energy storage in Australia at the moment. So how will this project contribute to that? So the Kidston Renewable Energy Hub uh, comprises 250 megawatts of pump storage hydro. Pump storage is really a giant water battery and it enables um, energy to be stored and dispatched when it's required. And um, the government, both the state government and the federal government, is very focused on energy security and energy storage. And our project is well timed to deliver that much needed storage into the into the grid. And finally, Simon, how is your construction timeline looking and how is this project going to contribute to the Queensland economy? So we're rapidly progressing the development now. We're, we're deeply engaged with financiers and we're on track to commence construction in 2018. The project is a very significant one. Not only will it generate clean green power for the Queensland grid, it will also generate 500 jobs and um, the government in Queensland is very supportive of any project that's a significant employment generator but also contributing to the, 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 the production of clean green energy. Simon Kidston, thanks for the update. You're welcome. Thanks, Caroline.